Hello my dear students, I am Divya and I am here again with a new topic, anti markonikovs rule. In my previous video, I had discussed about Markonikov's rule. Now, I am going to tell you uh, briefly about anti markonikovs rule. So, anti markonikovs rule is also known as peroxide effect and also known as Karash effect. Now let's discuss why we are studying anti markonikovs rule because uh, during the addition reaction of alkenes which is in your NCERT class 11th there is if there is presence of an peroxide then this rules come into picture okay it means in the presence of peroxide if addition of HBr is taking place to the alkene we need to apply this rule all right now here the peroxide is benzoyl peroxide and the reaction is this the reaction is when the unsymmetrical alkenes react with HBr in the presence of peroxide we are getting this one bromotropin all right now why this product is stable in this case in the presence of peroxide we need to discuss so let's discuss about the mechanism part so if you are dealing with the mechanism first of all this benzoyl peroxide there is a breakage of bond okay and as you know in the case of homolysis radicals are formed okay so what is happening here one of the electron of this bond go to this oxygen and one electron go to this oxygen okay and homolysis takes place we will get two molecule of this radical c6 h5 c double bond o and o with the radical two molecule of this we get okay and there are the two pairs of lone pairs also all right again what happened this carbon dioxide get released from this group right so what we get again two molecule of c6 h5 with the radical plus two molecule of carbon dioxide now this radical react with hbr and forms c6 h5 sorry h6 plus b r radical how it formed again there is a homolysis of this bond takes place and we get h radical and br radical this h radical get form attached to this group and form a bond and convert itself into c6 h6 benzene and now this radical which is formed will react with the alkene so when this br radical bromide radical react with alkene it forms two different intermediate c h3 c h c h the case first and this is the case second in the case first if br is adding to second carbon here the radical persist all right and if br is attaching to the first carbon radical get persist on the second carbon there is the, this this two possibilities here either radical persist on the first carbon or the second carbon okay so the again the same way you apply here also that which radical is most stable only that product will be the major one so here you can see that please remember the primary free radical is less stable 
as compared to secondary and tertiary so the order of this stability will be the tertiary free radical is much more stable as compared to the secondary one and then the last is this primary this is the order of free radical stability all right free radical stability so this uh, secondary this is the secondary free radical secondary free radical is stable so that's why the product which will which is going to form more stably is this ch3 ch2 ch2 br so you can see here that the negative part negative part means the br is going to that carbon which is having uh, which is having what which is having more number of hydrogens right more number of hydrogen but in the case of marikonikov the negative part goes to that carbon which is having lesser number of hydrogen that's why and if and also the product is which is formed here is different from the or you can say that the opposite to that of marikonikov's rule that's why we call this rule as anti marikonikov's rule and also remember in the case of markovnikov we can take hcl as well as hpr but in the case of anti markovnikov rule we can only take hbr as a reacting species okay and here the peroxide which we are taking is the benzoyl peroxide so this is all about the this is all about the anti markovnikov rule i hope you like this video so do like share and subscribe and support my channel and if you want me to teach some more topics so do comment in the comment section thank you so much